He's squishing the baby, Joopy. <laughs> He's squishing the baby. Good morning party people, welcome to today's vlog. Today I am week 15, day five of the pregnancy. I was going to vlog yesterday, however, this has been a very difficult week. I've been really, really struggling with mental health this past week. I haven't been feeling too off physically, but yeah, mental health has not been good. Yesterday I was like, a full-blown wreck, crying, <sighs> having a breakdown, all of that jazz. We're gonna try to be positive today. I'm gonna wash my face quick. I'm getting ready to go out. I'm gonna go to Tim Hortons and get some breakfast because I ran out of milk yesterday for my cereal and I don't want to eat anything that is in my house. I'm pretty sure that getting an appetite back at the beginning of the first trimester, pretty normal. That's definitely been true for me. I've been really freaking hungry the past few days. From there, I'm not really sure. I think I'm just gonna kind of take it casual and easy today. We'll see. I don't like to film sit down videos when I'm not in a good mood because then they, they end up being boring because I can't be as energetic as I'd like. The goal for the day will be to clean the kitchen then. The first trimester is so hard and really draining. And I was hoping that this week I would kick out of that, but it's not really happened. Anyways, let's get going. Let's get some breakfast. I'm starving. Headless baby. That was a really nice little walk. It's really nice out. I got an iced coffee, a hash brown that I already started eating, and two bacon and egg breakfast sandwiches on an English muffin. And I'm going to watch, my hair is all crazy from the wind. Um, I'm gonna watch some TV, maybe a movie. So, I just finished watching a movie, just like a random rom-com, nothing crazy. Much more relaxed now and just better. <laughs> I've been finding that taking it easy and not pushing myself too hard has been really worthwhile for me. My hips have been really, really sore. I've been seeing a chiropractor since 11 weeks and that was to help me with some hip problems that I had before getting pregnant. But the past week or two, I've really felt a shift and that pain that I had before is, yeah, it's still kind of there, but we did a lot of work on it at Cairo and got to a pretty decent place. But right now my hips are in like, <laughs> So much pain and it's definitely transformed into I, I think it's pregnancy pain <laughs> like my hips are starting to move when you're pregnant you start to release different hormones that loosen up your joints and loosen up your ligaments get things in a spot where they can shift obviously your hips and your pelvis change a lot throughout pregnancy and childbirth I'm going to do some prenatal yoga. I'll show you a clip. It's from Pregnancy and Postpartum TV. It's a 12 minute yoga flow for all the trimesters. That's it. I'm going to press play and uh, get going on this. Like this, please subscribe and hit the notification bell. <laughs> Yeah, 
that was a good little yoga flow. It went by really fast. It was a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be for me. I really am not that flexible sometimes. So yeah, but <laughs> I do feel much better. I have um, definitely got some relief in my lower back from that. So that's great. This is literally perfect because the fridge is not making noise right now. Here we are, welcome to my kitchen. If you guys have never seen it before, here it is. It's small. Let me close the window. What the plan is, is to clean it all up. Step one, do dishes. Step two, give everything a wipe. And step three is to clean the floor. I'm gonna get a drink of water, put on some music, and we're gonna, we're gonna knock this out. Get it done. All right, here we go. Hello. I'm done all the dishes finally it took forever I'm I have a cloth all-purpose cleaning spray I'm gonna do all the counters and stove first Because we don't have a ventilation fan in our kitchen, everything in the kitchen gets a layer of grease on it. And that also means that everything in the kitchen gets a layer of grease covered in cat hair. Because we do have two cats. So once I'm done wiping things down, I go in with one single piece of paper towel just to pick up all the remaining cat hair. I decided to finish doing the wiping down of things off camera because I was getting really tired and now I'm like dead exhausted. <laughs> so I'm gonna have a snack and then I'm gonna call it there for cleaning today. I didn't finish the kitchen, but the only thing I have left to do is the floors. So you know what, I'm pretty happy with that and I'll do it tomorrow morning. My energy's still been pretty low in week 15. So I'm hoping that my energy comes back soon because I'm wiped. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, I'm gonna have a snack, probably some carrots and hummus. Then I'm gonna start editing this vlog. So I'm gonna call it there for the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget, give the video a big thumbs up, press that subscribe down below. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.